Good evening, everyone. The title to our research observation project is Before the Lecture Starts. Tonight, speaking to you throughout this presentation will be Diana Ortega and Kirena Milan. Every day, thousands of students go to college to sit in a classroom setting where they take notes and listen to a professor's lecture. In many universities, students arrive a few minutes before class. At their arrival, while standing outside of the classroom, the students are waiting for the professor to arrive, waiting for the previous class to be over, or waiting until some type of commotion happens within the entrance of the classroom. As students, began to, as students, as students we began to question why is it that students wait for something to happen before entering the classroom. We have noticed that many students do not like to feel awkward or different. Therefore, they wait until someone breaks the ice. For that reason, we decided to, to we decided to observe students outside the classroom to see what they will, to see the things that they do. Our research question was: Does it matter to students when entering a classroom whether or not they should enter based on who has already entered or who has left? How did we conduct the study? We are a group of three girls. We basically decided to take two classes each and observe them. We observed the classes Monday through Friday except for Wednesdays because there's no class on that day. But the times that we observed were between the hours of 1 to 6.20. We observed the students' actions. We looked to answer questions such as, does a student enter the classroom when another student enters? Do students wait for the professor to get there first and then they enter after them or after her? Do students walk into the walk into the classroom because their previous class had just walked out? Based on our observation from the six classes that we observed, the majority of students would wait for a commotion to happen in order for them to enter the classroom. Our results indicate that we used six different classes. The first one is deviant behavior. The second one, I think. The third class, the liar. The fourth class, ethics. The fifth class, complementary religion. And the sixth class, pro seminar. Our data indicated from that from the 138 students that we observed in total for all six classes indicated that for the deviant behavior class, 19 students who were in that classroom entered when the previous class was over. For the I think class, from the 30 students that were in there, 100% entered when the professor was already there. From the liar class, 25 students that were there, only 15% of them entered when one student entered first. From the ethics class, a total of 23 students and 100% entered because the previous class was over. For the complementary religion class, from the 22 students that were there, 75% students entered when the, class, when the professor entered first. And for, for the pro-seminar class, from the 19 students, only 71% of them entered when another student entered in first. With that being said, students will enter the classroom no matter if a student or a professor enters the classroom first, instead of a student entering there alone. By the end of our four-week observation, there were many things we had noted. One of those things was date and time could be irrelevant when studying students' observations. Referring back to our research question, we came up with an answer, and the answer is yes. Do, students do take into matter whether or not they should enter a classroom based on the people who are either walking in or out or if the professor has yet arrived or not. We also came up with ideas after our observation that we could have done while conducting our study, which was we could have um, provided a survey for students in which they'll tell us what do they do in their other what, in their other classes. Also, we mentioned earlier that students do not like to feel awkward or different. For many students, entering the classroom late can be uncomfortable because usually when they enter late, everyone looks looks at them or all the attention is completely on them. Therefore, we would like to ask questions on our surveys such as, what do they do in cases where they're entering late? Do you prefer not to go to class or, you, or do you just go late even though you're, you know you're going to feel uncomfortable? For further research, we should have a participant from each class purposely enter the classroom first. For future reference, what could have been done better is that next time, we should ask a close friend to be a participant and enter the classroom first to better see if the class will follow him or her first. Also, we can ask the professor to participate in the study and purposely enter five minutes late to see if students will wait outside or enter the classroom when he or she enters first. Thank you for your time. I hope, you got, I hope all of you enjoyed our presentation.
We look forward to hearing your critiques and comments.